relate to velocity in two dimension if velocity of a is va and velocity of b is vb then relate to velocity of a with respect to b is equal to va minus vb or relate to velocity of b with respect to a that is vb minus va for suppose two bodies a and b are moving in different directions with velocities v a and v b by making an angle theta between them then here if i want to find relative velocity of a with respect to b i have to take negative velocity of b that is opposite to velocity of b this is minus v b the resultant of a and b gives relative velocity of a with respect to b so here if i construct parallelogram then i can calculate resultant of relative velocity of a with respect to b that is vab is equal to root over va square plus vb square okay plus 2 va minus vp cos theta then i will get the resultant of relative velocity of a with respect to b uh, root over va square plus vb square minus 2 va vb cos theta similarly if i want to find relative velocity of b with respect to a then again i will take diagram here both a and b are moving in different directions with velocities v a and v b by making an angle theta between them then here i will take negative velocity of a opposite to velocity of a that is minus v a then resultant of velocity of b and velocity of a gives relative velocity of b with respect to a so here also if i construct parallelogram then i will get resultant of velocity of b with respect to a is equal to root over vb square plus va square plus 2 into vb minus va cos theta then resultant of relative velocity of b with respect to a is equal to root over vb square plus va square minus 2 vb va cos theta okay now special cases first one if a and b are moving in same direction that is theta is equal to how much same direction means 0 degree then resultant of a with respect to b is equal to root over va square plus vb square minus 2 va vb cos 0 degree then we will get root over va minus vb whole square then root and square cancelled with each other so we will get resultant of relative velocity of a with respect to b 
when they are moving in same direction that is VA minus VB. Now second case, if A and V are moving in opposite direction, if A and B are moving in opposite direction, that is theta equal to 180 degrees, then relative velocity of A with respect to B is equal to root over VA square plus VB square minus 2 VA VB cos 180 degrees. Cos 180 means minus 1. So, we will get root over VA plus VB whole square. Then square root cancelled. So, we got relative velocity of A with respect to B when they are moving in opposite direction that is VA plus VB. Third case. If A and B are perpendicular to each other, that means theta equal to 90 degrees, then relative velocity of A with respect to B, we will get root over VA square plus VB square minus 2 VA. VB cos 90 degree. Cos 90 means 0. Then we will get relative velocity of A with respect to B is equal to root over VA square plus VB square. So we got relative velocity of A with respect to B when they are perpendicular to each other. That is root over VA square plus VB square. Okay.